is pretending around you guys this person is pretending because they feel that as long as they pretend as long as they keep on this weird mask about them because you know it's weird you can feel the energy uh, they keep the control this is all about control and wanting to keep uh, again safe face and manipulate the energy so that they can keep control over this relationship whatever relationship this is whether it's business or love or friendship mm -hmm. this person feels that they have let's say the last say no matter what what else do you need to know four of wands knight of cups the devil <laughs> capricorn energy three of wands and at the bottom we have the two of pentacles is someone who is overwhelmed by your energy you guys there's something about your energy that is at the same time pissing them off but also attracting them very strongly there's a lot of doubts you just put them in doubts whatever they thought was rightful whatever they thought was the right way or things were used to be done that way you change their mind or you are changing their mind or you are kind of destructing whatever those thoughts were um, around a specific subject and area you're distracting those thoughts and this is very destabilizing for this person this is someone especially with Capricorn energy this is someone who cares about stable stable energy who cares about doing the same thing over and over again or just following certain theme a uh, certain theme or certain step-by-step -step kind of thing you are changing that and this is scary to them they could have a dog this person could have a tattoo specifically a hand tattoo or something around their forearm or their um here could have a hand tattoo here uh, this could also be someone with aries placements i'm also here in scorpio placements so this person is like i said destabilized and they used to have a plan for themselves when it comes to their life this is changing because of you 211 in the clock 222 in the clock you guys have changed everything around it and at the same time they're curious but at the same time it's like they don't believe that it's possible like they see you maybe some of you are working with crystals you guys could have spoken about crystal healing they think that it's not possible like how do you guys do it how do you guys make things happen for yourself with things that they believe are not true don't exist are not realistic page of cups page of pentacles the fool aries energy knight of swords we have the hermit virgo energy at the bottom all right this is a creature of habit definitely this is someone who is into um whenever they get light-hearted whenever they like to be let's say connected to their inner child they don't do this in front of others you are the only one who kind of affected them that way so that they opened up to you in a very light-hearted way they have fun with you they enjoy their time with you they joke around with you but again they don't take things seriously the things that you say to them especially if it comes to spirituality or beliefs things that let's say are not very scientific they are saying to themselves is this even serious is this person even serious they might not tell you that page of one exactly they might not even tell you that but they're at the same time curious but they're not really they're in disbelief okay page of cups page of pentacles this is someone who really enjoys having fun time with you they like to have some kind of humor with you You just brought this fresh energy with the fool they really like to be foolish enjoy their life with you knights of souls they be you know they like to speak to you but there's a bit of a superficiality to this energy gemini by the way picking up on gemini <laughs> We have the Nine of Wands, Knight of Wands, the Eight of Wands, and the Justice card. All right. Mm -hmm. You guys were meant to meet this person. There was, uh, I'm here, it's part of your trajectory, it's part of your journey. You're the one who is going to be changing their life. And it's coming in a way that is unexpected for them. So again, I'm saying, this is lighthearted energy. This is not heavy, so they don't expect it to change their life, but it's going to it's going to so you guys are going to change not only the way they see life but also the way they communicate with others the way they speak about themselves the way they speak about life the way they see um 
possibilities their reality is changing it's shifting it has been shifting but they've been blocking the shift nine of wands they've been blocking the shift they haven't been ready to take on this new shift sagittarius energy by the way strong sagittarius energy the empress king of pentacles capricorn empress taurus libra by the way and we have the strength card leo oh my god four of pentacles in reverse all right so whatever uh, this person could have been very selfish i have to say especially with people around them especially possibly with feminines in general this is someone who could have been taking anything that's feminine or related to the feminine energy as something weak or not powerful the magician yes this is someone who could have even manipulated many feminines um virgo energy gemini energy this is someone who has I'm hearing disrespect the feminine and you guys empress energy you're showing up very differently 555 five, five in the clock king of pentacles you guys are learning teaching them that you know what now whenever they want to manifest something stable something real something even financially uh, prosperous in their life they're gonna have to go through the beautiful feminine energy venus here strong venus energy they're gonna have to respect the feminine with the strength card there is a change here when it comes to the sh some kind of energy shift here happening for them and it's thanks to you yes the lovers some of you this person is very falling for you and person lovers they see someone who's absolutely gorgeous there is some kind of attraction here whether it's love or not there is a strong deep attraction we have ace of cups yes for some of you it's definitely this person is falling for you of pentacles and for others it is someone you're working with but they have again an attraction they can't really help it there's very strong attraction seven of cups they think about you they dream about you you just change their reality you change the way they see the world you changed their uh, you making them shift around yes death and it's in the reverse they're really resisting this they've been resisting this for a while they've been called on by their ancestors by the spirit guys to start moving forward with this new energy but they didn't want to listen to the call and you guys are pushing that ace of cups three of pentacles in a way that's very subtle actually very subtle they can't see it because it's the feminine energy here working on them so it's very emotional as well there is an emotional shift here whatever was fulfilling to them is no more fulfilling there's a change especially when it comes to their fine uh, their work they used to think that this is fulfilling to me this is the kind of work I want to do. This is making me happy. I love putting my energy in this type of work. This is changing. There's a new beginning when it comes to the way they see their work. And this is actually manifesting in their life, but it's also changing many people's lives. So this person could be in a high position or they could have some kind of impact or influence on other people. The Hermit is Virgo energy. Seven of Wands. Queen of Swords. Definitely someone who's been... Uh, hiding from some kind of enlightenment some kind of spiritual awakening that was happening around them and they didn't want to look at it that wisdom that needed to be uh, accessed you know they put their hand up and they said no i don't want it i'm blocking it the star energy in reverse this has helped this has been okay for a while but this is changing queen of swords it's you you are changing that you are changing that with your words with the way you communicate with them even though you have this playful energy even though you guys could have fun there is a certain time where you guys stand up for yourself there's a certain time where you become irrational logical straightforward libra energy and that when that happens they have to fight you make them feel like they have to fight for their beliefs they have to stand up for what they believe and they realize that actually their beliefs are not that strong they are not that substantial compared to what you have to bring for absorbs in reverse they need to do their healing and they're gonna have to make it happen whether they've been fighting it whether they've been hiding from it this is happening for them king of cups in reverse they've been hiding their feelings and this is becoming toxic for them and they know that now i hope this was helpful